Look at this. You want to come see this video. It's just wow. in the wake of a tornado that tore through Kansas over the weekend. This new video shows destruction caused by it. Take a look. Drone video captured an, a, an EF3 tornado, which ripped through Andover, Kansas. This was on Friday. The tornado called a 13-mile stretch of destruction through south central Kansas, destroyed over a thousand buildings. Four people were hurt. No one died. People sheltering inside a YMCA showed the destruction after they came out. Holy f Oh my God. Oh my God. The city's fire chief said it will take years for Andover to recover from the storm. He said the city still has scars that ripped through Andover. Uh, and it was it was almost 31 years ago. And when I saw this video, I immediately started sending texts mm -hmm. to friends of mine yeah. because I lived through the tornado wow. that was in Andover 31 years ago, 1991. 17 people died back then. Wow. Um, and it's uh, we were talking about it before the show. It's much like the Northridge quake here mm -hmm. is just anybody knows it. Bam. <laughs> Residents in northern Puerto Rico witnessed a rare tornado sweep across the city of Arecibo on Sunday as severe thunderstorms rattled the island during the afternoon hours. Several views of the swirling vortex emerged across social media from locals who captured footage of the flying debris and downed palm tree fronds. After crews surveyed the damage on Sunday, forecasters with the National Weather Service office in the capital city of San Juan gave the twister a preliminary rating of an EF1 on the enhanced Fujita scale, defined by winds ranging between 86 and 110 miles per hour. Further damage assessments will continue to compile more information about the event, and the final rating of the tornado may change. Tornadoes are a rarity in Puerto Rico. The island is far more prone to hurricanes, having been severely impacted by storms such as Maria and Irma in 2017. On average, the island is impacted by a tropical cyclone once every year or two. The last recorded tornadic event in Puerto Rico was in September of 2019. Guarda todo, señor. From wildfires to severe storms, the United States is grappling with extreme weather events. Recently, a massive tornado tore through the town of Fort Stockton in Texas. Eyewitnesses recorded footage that showed the destruction caused there. According to the local police, the storm damaged several mobile homes and tipped trucks onto their sites. However, the police did not report any fatalities. On Monday, the National Weather Service Department issued red flag warnings for southwest and western Texas. The warning was also issued in southeast New Mexico, a state already grappling with wildfire outbreaks. Earlier, tornadoes created havoc in Texas. Nearly two dozen people were injured. As the tornado swept through central Texas, they, they were a part of a storm system that was expected to be extremely severe along with damaging winds. The storms caused widespread damage in the town of Salado in Texas. Meanwhile, in Bell County, 23 people were injured. The National Weather Service Department had confirmed that the tornado packed winds of 100 kilometers per hour. A second tornado also struck central Texas around the same time. Authorities said that about 61 homes and two churches were damaged in the tornado's paths.